And what happens is there is a drift. The drift could be that the model itself somehow is changing with time. Now this happens, this can happen for a number of reasons. It depends on the type of system. Some models are kind of fixed. Others might drift and change with time. The drift that we're talking about is it is it slowly moving away from where you had already tested it and you thought this is good, check mark, you know, everybody's trying to be good about their governance. It will drift away. What often happens, a lot of models are kind of fixed. It's like, I haven't changed my model, it's working fine. But all of a sudden it starts behaving differently. It acts like it's not, it's drifting. What's actually happening is that the distribution of the data that's coming in is different. How can that happen? Well, I tested it on my North American, or let's say I tested it in, for a couple sites in uh, in uh, New York and, and New Jersey. I start slowly rolling it out to my different things and all of a sudden I start seeing that the types of insurance claims I'm getting in California are very different than the ones I got in New York and New Jersey. And now all of a sudden, it looks like the model is changed, behaving differently. It's not as accurate. It's not as precise, whatever. That, those combination of things, and it can be the data, it can be the model, it can be a combination of both. And that's the, that's the risk is that you thought you knew what it was doing. And so the way you track that is, well, there's lots of different ways, but you have testing and evaluation, a test suite that's going to test it continuously, and you start looking for shifts in that test. Sometimes you don't have the data to do that. And so what you do is you look at the distribution of the data. Like here's the dish, like looks like a little bell curve. Let's pretend a little plot of the distribution of the data, the insurance claims from New Jersey and, and New York. And then as I'm adding new states, I'm looking at that distribution relative to the original distribution. And what I see is all of a sudden it starts doing this. And I'm like, even though I can't tell what's going on is it good or bad i know something's going on and i'm like okay i need to go in and reevaluate because it was right on top of each other and now it's shifted and so that's the kind of practical aspect of it but it just means things are changing with time and it's drifting in a domain where you don't know how good your model is actually behaving